In this demonstration, I'm very excited to share with you the Dairy Trace link. That link can be found under the Cow's Head Management menu, number 12 for links, and number 8 Pro Action. Here you have number 1, where you'll be working on all of your events to submit, and number 2, which is a reference for items that have already been sent through the program. In your To Send page, you'll have animals listed by number and an LID tag, type of the event with the date and the details, a status message, a transporter license plate, and then a time frame check code. That check code gives you an idea of whether or not the event is being submitted within the recommended time frame. You'll notice the top portion of the screen is blue and they say to be sent correct, while the bottom portion of the screen says to be sent incorrect and they're in red. In the beginning, you'll want to make sure that your premises ID is set up correctly in farm data. Under program settings and farm data, including the capitalized province code. You'll also want to verify that your suppliers are up to date. You can simply double click on those and edit them to add the relevant information. You'll want to make sure that the country, province, and premises ID are included. And if that supplier is a transporter, you'll want to check the box for transporter and make sure that the license plate is correct. Back in the Dairy Trace screen, we'll go into your properties and choose communication settings. Here, we can add your Dairy Trace account number starting with the DT and make sure that that's capitalized as well as your web service settings, which is your username and your password to log into the Dairy Trace web portal. This is also case sensitive. Finally, at the bottom, select Dairy Trace and choose OK. In your send data screen here on the properties, you can choose how many days back you want to send events and then which events that you'd like to submit. Choose OK. Once you're back here, you should have just a few left that need to be corrected. This one, for example, if I double click, it takes me to her animal record and I can see her diet event. If I double click on that again, I see there's no supplier listed. I can browse and choose my dead stock supplier and say okay. Once I go back to the Dairy Trace screen, everything will be blue and ready to send. Events can be submitted using the send button on the bottom toolbar. If you have any questions about how this link works, please give us a call at the help desk.